getting down to your cleaning. So everyone, when you buy a gun, really, when you clean that gun, it should be cleaned every time you use it. Guns are made of very high quality steel, especially Brownings. Um, if some of you out there have got a Browning or Maruku and they leave it for a little bit, the barrels rust. And this rust, because they're made of that high quality steel, you really need to be cleaning it every time. A lot of people clean it once a, once a month, a couple of times a month, which is fine, but really it should be done every time you use it. So the first thing you wanna do is you've got your, your Foster Bonds brush. This is the harder one within your cleaning kit. And then you've got your wall brush. This is the softer one. The harder one through first to get all the big lumps out and then you polish it with your softer one afterwards. Then you've got your patches. And again, you can take this off, unscrew this. Again, there is a tool for this, but my way of doing it, take your patch, put it over there or wrap your patch around this and push it down the barrel and that is a way of cleaning it. You've got your gun oil. You have bore cleaner as well, um, which cleans the bores in here. I actually use gun oil pretty much for everything. I think gun oil, that's really all you need. You always need to keep a tin of gun oil. There's various different makes and models, but any old gun oil will be as good as anything. Your toothbrush. So get yourself an old toothbrush out of the bathroom. You ain't gonna use it afterwards, so keep it in your kit. And then a duster. Again, most cleaning kits come with a new duster. Best thing to do is have an old duster um, that's got a bit of, bit of wear and tear in it, so it doesn't, um, when you wipe the whole gun down, doesn't really um, put anything on it. It's nice and soft duster. So the first thing we'll do is you look down the gun and you can see where I've shot this gun. You can see the bits. So you put your harder brush down there first and you polish it like that. Both barrels. And then this goes down afterwards and polishes it like that. Once you've done that, so you've polished that like that. And again, if you look down there, it should be nice and shiny down there. Then you close it up and you take the chokes out. Now this, you don't have to do every time you shoot it, but you want to do it every now and again. If you don't do this every now and again, the chokes, all the mess will get in there and they will weld themselves in and you won't get your chokes out. So. Depending how well you, how, how much you shoot the gun, you probably want to take them out a couple of times a month. Take them out, clean them, put them back in again. And you can look at how dirty that is. Again, most guns come with their own choke key. This is something I made up, which is just a ratchet, which is a lot easier. So you can see how dirty that is. And then what you do, a bit of oil on there, with your toothbrush, you clean the threads off like that. And again, if you've left this in and you've shot it a lot, those threads will get clogged up with all gunk. So that's where the threads, you need to take these out every now and again, otherwise they weld themselves in. So that goes like that, and that comes out a nice clean pristine choke. And then you go for the next one. And then you put, to clean the threaded bit here, you put that, that down like that, you give it a good, good polish like that. So it cleans the threads in the barrels. And then you close them back up and you put the chokes back in again. Just nip them up so they're not loose. 
with external chokes, if you keep them clean, they can come loose. So just check them every now and again, just check that they are tight, just finger tight. And then when you're shooting, that's where you see people just doing that. Just make sure they're tight. And then you take the gun bar, start with the stock end. Again, if you look in there where the bow, where you shot it, you can see the rings. You can tell how much it's been shot by looking at those rings there and how much has been looked after. So that is where really you need to be cleaning that gun. So squirt a little bit of oil in there. Doesn't have to be loads. With your toothbrush, clean that. And then get your oily rag and with that and if you look in there, there you no mark and then the same thing you do the same thing with this again a little bit of oil in the ejectors and then you get your toothbrush Like that, like that. And then you put that back together again there. And don't forget that your hands, with all the oily hands, all the sweat of your hands, the more you touch that, it makes it rust. So don't forget just to run a little bit of oil over that. Like that. And then polish and clean that like that. And that is one clean gun from there. You can wax the stock, that's not, that's just whether you want to do it. But that is the, the basic stuff that you have to do to a gun to clean and look after your gun. I hope you've all enjoyed this film. I hope you found this interesting. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you next week.